How are we feeling about uh, the Raptors? You feeling good about the uh, Scotty Barnes is balling? Do you, yeah, are you, you a know, I, I, yeah, 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 yeah. But you know what? I haven't even been paying attention to no sports, like not even football this year for some reason. Are you? I, a, I know you. You play football. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I coach now a little bit too. You know what I'm saying? But like, but I used to. I used okay. to really play. Are we talking about soccer or football? No, American football. Okay, American. I gotta ask because you're Gridiron. from a different country, and I know in foot. You got you everywhere got else. Football Canadian is fucking football soccer. too. We got we got a league. Yeah, no one watches the CFL. I watch it, man. I'm Canadian. You know, yeah, Canadians, we watch it. Do they, it's the our NFL, league, do they have the NFL on in Canada? Of course we do. Yeah, we got the NFL. Yeah, I, I don't know. We, we, yeah, we got we got we watch we got everything. We got everything. So you play yeah. football? What like tackle football? Yeah, yeah, tackle football. But so in, you, in in Canada, we don't have four downs. We have three downs. It's weird. Really? Yeah, and our football is like bigger. We, it's like, it's different. So you have a bigger ball. Yeah, a bigger football field as well. It's like 120 yards. Yeah, it's crazy. The end zone's huge, man. It's like back in the day, 1950s style football. Wait, is that how football. the CFL is? Yeah, my, yeah. go search up, type in CFL highlights, whatever. You'll see how big the field Giant is. Giant ball. It's yeah, it's big, bro. So you're like, you have pads on and a helmet and shit. Everything. Yeah, I'm number 80. Yeah. Are you a wide receiver? Yeah, I was a wide receiver and a, a safety and a punter. But mainly receiver, yeah. When you're punting, kicking, yeah, yeah, punting, catching, and yeah, defending, and, and yeah, yeah, I'm the I'm the the deep help. What got That's you into me. football? My dad. Your My dad's dad. a football guy. Yeah, when he moved to Guyana, uh, from Guyana to Canada, mm-hmm. uh, the first um, football game he ever seen was the Chicago Bears. I think it was when the year they won the Super Bowl, the 85 Bears. Yeah. And, you know, he just fell in love with the Bears. So he's a Bears fan. He's a Bears, yeah, he's a Bears fan. I'm a Steelers fan. Yeah, so. You're a Bears Steelers fan. fan. Yeah, I'm a Steelers fan for what, life. What yeah. gravitated you towards the Steelers? I don't Canada? know. I used to play, I used to play Madden all the time and I used to watch their games sometimes and I was just like, yo, I you just love, love the way Big they play ben? football. No, no, this is back. Jerome Bettis? Jerome Bettis and Cordell Stewart. Cordell and, was a beast. Yeah, when Plaxico was on the team. Plaxico burst for a shot Hines himself. Ward, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that happened. Yeah, Troy, but Troy wasn't on the team them times yeah. then over so then i remember when i watched the 05 uh, 06 super bowl when they played seahawks that time i was like holy shit there was a whole new team right but it was the last game for bettis and i watched that and i was like oh my god this is just it was different for me when i was a kid so like, have you yeah, been to a steelers was, game and in- you know i've never been to a steelers game i actually want to do that this tour i want to do that you gotta I go, about, yeah i want to go i want to go yeah i want to catch one man yeah, yeah see no, kenny pickett and gp and these guys man yeah mm. Hey man, I, I don't know me. how you guys are six and three. It's the biggest mystery to me. It's, you guys are the luckiest crazy. team ever because you guys <laughs> don't have much talent. We're on trying offense. to. We're trying to. No, we, it's, we have talent. It's Najee just Harris to it out. somehow is washed in his third no, year. No, it's not. He's not washed. No. Jalen Warren is way better than Najee no, Harris. Oh my God! You see the outside criticism is crazy. Jalen Warren <laughs> just had 110 yards. In a, yeah, I, know, I know. I see. Team. And Najee had like 83. I seen how much carries it was. Similar, Yo, Najee you know Harris. I don't know how he just fell off. Nah, like, it's rookie it's, year I feel was like solid. It's the system. I feel like the system that they're trying to um, play in right now, like with Matt Canada. It's too all over the place. They don't have a right. ident- as they said an identity right now. You know, are they? Are you a pass? Ha- are you a pass team? Are you do you pass deep? Are you just trying to run first? Like, what are you guys doing? Like, nobody knows over there. So what you the believe in on. Kenny Pickett? I, yeah, he has talent. I've seen. But you I know, believe like that's your quarterback. This I believe he can definitely take us somewhere. Yes, if he really? has. Yes, man. The guy when I seen in him in his AFC. rookie when I seen him in his rookie season and I seen him making progressions. This is the conference that has Joe Burrow. I know. Josh I see them Allen, being. Patrick yes. Mahomes. Yes. Justin Herbert. Yes. Can he pick it? I feel like once he gets is in the, a what fucking a, bomb. No, he's not, man. He is a homeless man. No, my God, you're, <laughs> the hate is crazy. Can he pick it? Is no, man. The man was making progressions as a young quarterback. That was like that's that's insane. He just needs to. There's so many good things. I seen making the right, right decisions in his rookie year like when he really started getting the groove I said yo there's a lot of potential that they mm. can work on right here you know what I'm saying but they have no idea very young offensive line very, everybody's so young on that uh, on that offense Kenny Pickett so and Mitch Trubisky are not that far apart no they are far apart definitely I feel like they're far apart come on I feel like you gotta give Kenny I feel like no. some some more time yeah a little chat look one more year yeah, especially okay. with a different OC and then I'll make my assumption on how you know what I'm saying. He's I terrible. He's gonna go. He's terrible. Nah, man. He's, he's mid, terrible. bro. I feel like I feel like they could. You rather have Josh Dobbs? Josh Alopecia. Play, Josh, Josh Dobbs is playing really nice. Exactly. Right now. You could have. You could. But but he mind you, he was on the Steelers. He was, and you guys yeah. should have. You, you had he was him. on the Steelers. Then yeah. he went to the Browns. Then yeah. he went to my Cardinals. Then we yeah. traded him to the yeah. Vikings. And then Vikings, and he's balling right now. Crazy. Mm. I believe in Kenny, though. I believe in Kenny. You do. You're, you're, I believe in you're Kenny. a sweet guy because you're famous and you know you might meet him one day. <laughs> no, I really believe in Kenny, man. I watched you're the guy liar. play, man. No, I'm not. Kenny, Kenny Pickett. I believe in you. I Nobody him on believes the Ram, in him. Bro. I like, of course I like you what do. I, see. I like what I see, man. No one believes I, in Kenny. I believe he's going to. Yeah, man. I feel like once he gets in the right situation, once he gets, like, you know, once they fix their identity on offense, I feel like. 
We can see some right. re- something really happen, dog. Exactly. You see fourth quarter Kenny. Yeah. We all, you see him in the fourth quarter. The man's going crazy like he's Brady over there. Right. You see it. Come on. You don't yeah. you're telling me you're not seeing the fourth quarter highlights, bro. You guys have gotten lucky all season long. <laughs> there's actually a stat, because I gamble, and there's like a way they oh. figure out like the luckiest teams. <laughs> And the over the last three years, the Pittsburgh Steelers have the, the, the yeah. most. They're the most lucky team of football because very of how close their wins are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we're always winning the, by very close. They margins. barely just won one point three points. Yeah, yeah we're crazy. winning by those. Even with Ben, though, that's what was going. Well, because Ben was like a corpse. Yeah, but I mean, I feel like it's really just for like the last five years of Ben's career, he was like the Joe Biden of quarterbacks, like just waiting for him to like fall. I, like break everybody leg, was, fall, but he know. was still slinging it. He wasn't the same old Ben, but he was still slinging it. Shout out to the Steelers. Who would have thought, huh? Yeah, man. You guys I, beat I, my car- I, I, I'm a Cardinals fan. Steelers. You guys beat us in the Super Bowl. Look at that. And you have so much to say. Oh, fuck the Steelers, man. I hate the fucking Steelers. <laughs> I can tell. No wonder. No wonder. No wonder this energy is coming so heavy from this I side of the room the right truth. now. You know Kenny what I'm saying? Pickett is a bum. He's not, man. You guys are going to draft somebody. Watch, man. No, I feel like he can do amazing things. You just got to give him some patience. Yeah, like get score the right 13. System going on and we'll right. figure it out. Yeah. Trust me, man. Okay. Trust well, me. Watch, watch, watch. Yeah, you got to go to a game. I can't believe. I can't. I got to. I really got to. Have you been to a football game? At yes, all? yes, yes, yes. Yeah. I've been to a, yeah an NFL game. My first one was the Chargers against Patriots last here. Last yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. Oh, yeah. Man. Lost Chargers against the Patriots. Are depressing, huh? It was because I like and... Herbert, man. No, I like. No, no, they're great, but the fact that they put this team in the middle of LA that no one in LA gives a fuck about. I don't know. I don't know why they did that. When they were from San Diego. Kept them in San Diego. San Diego loved them. You, any but, Chargers game the is the Rams it? here too. I was very confused. Because the Rams has already been the, here from the, how the many Chargers years ago? Chargers games are just away games for them. I mean, I, I, I I'm like sure the when you went, there was tons of Patriots fans. There was so much Patriots fans. Yep. I was very surprised. I couldn't believe it. But I, it, was a great, it was a great game though. You know, the Chargers, I feel like they're a team that just always comes up short. You never for know sure. Just well, it's because their coach is a fucking idiot. But I mean, it's been happening since like what? Oh, six, the 80s, actually. Yeah, since Thomason and all that. But, I mean, Even like. Before Thomason, and, and Dan I mean, Feltz. Listen. We're talking Dan Feltz and Kevin yeah. Winslow times. They're cursed. I don't know why. They're amazing offense, amazing players, yeah. so many stars, but they just can't finish games. Yeah, that's true. It I is rough. They ju- who they just lose to? Oh, the Lions. Yeah, that was a good they just game. just lost the Lions? Yeah, I didn't even know that. Yes, yeah, yeah, they did. Yeah, it was a close game, too. Yeah, Very it was like three game, points yeah. or something. So, um, yeah. how how long? Obviously, you're going to get off tour soon. You're about halfway through. Yeah. How uh, how soon are you going to go back in to make, make the next album? I'm already, I'm, already, I'm already working on it. I've already been working, working on it. Yeah, I'm already working on it. I'm already working on it. I'm so, working on a lot of music right now. Was it when's it early next year? Yeah, yeah. I want to get that out first quarter. So you're yeah, not gonna not make playing. everybody wait uh, I'm half not, a decade. Kevin, I'm not playing with him. <laughs> I'm not playing with him, Kevin. I was gonna okay. say, like, uh for you, like, cause you know, a span of five years, people come and go, right? Like yeah. music changes. Yeah. TikTok probably wasn't popping like that in 2018, 2019. No, it really it, wasn't. It just started actually. Yeah, so it's like the whole music industry kind of changes for you, like, uh, you know, how do you like kinda Still make people give a fuck. Because uh. <laughs> once you go away so long, man, fans move on. They find yeah. new people. Like, but yeah. obviously you're still doing your thing. You the tour is going crazy. But like to me, it's like hard to like be gone for five years per yeah. se. I mean, you were dropping some shit, but like and like still make people care. Like, yeah, I mean, it was I was hard because I I was even trying to figure it out. And I feel like it's just me being naturally honest in myself. Yeah, I can't do no gimmicky bullshit and feel like that's gonna you know what I'm saying I'm just not that person or that artist. Right. Never been. So I'm just honest, and that has been it's been door opening. It's been eye opening. It's been you know what I'm saying because they now get to I'm letting him in. I've been so reserved. I'm so closed off. Yeah. So I feel like because when I was telling you about you know the industry and everything, I feel like it just made me just go into my own little bubble you know so i didn't let my even my fans in that bubble so right. now that i'm letting them in i feel like that's what i feel like that's the only thing that they've been missing really from me besides me obviously dropping right. music right so that connection just rebuilding that connection you know 